Hello and welcome to this our uh, Christingle lighting service, a really short service for us to gather together to light our Christingles and to reflect on what the Christingle represents and to learn a little about the children's the children's society who launched this initiative uh, many many years ago. In fact, they've celebrated their fiftieth anniversary. I am Mother Lucy and I'm the curate in charge of the parishes of Pagham and Aldwick and it is my pleasure to lead you through this service. You find me here in the chapel at St Richard's Church in Aldwick and we are surrounded by candlelight to help us to reflect on that importance of the light of Christ in the darkness. Christingle services this year will look very different. We are not gathered together in one or other of our churches and we cannot sing carols in our church, but I hope that the same will be true, that we will be able to share in the light and hope that we know of Jesus Christ, who always shines in the darkness. I would like us now just very briefly to watch a short film provided by the Children's Society to teach us a little bit more about the work that they do. Thank you for sharing the light of Chris Dingle and helping disadvantaged children and young people in the darkest of situations. We've all been through a lot this year and unfortunately disadvantaged young people have been some of the hardest hit by the pandemic. For the young carers who have been shouldered with more responsibility than ever. The young people who have experienced devastating effects on their mental health. Or the missing children who have nowhere to shelter for the night. We need your kindness more than ever. Together, we can rekindle the hope inside these vulnerable children and provide the safety net they so urgently need. Your Christingle donations will help run vital services all across the country, helping children through one-to-one -one counselling and dedicated project workers. You can guide the most vulnerable children to a brighter future. The kindness of Christinglers like you will help bring hope and optimism to the lives of young people. Please give what you can today and let children in this country know just how much they matter. Thank you. And so let us pray for the Children's Society, for their workers and all those who use their services. Lord Jesus, light of the world, as I hold my Christingle and think about your great love for me, and for those, especially in places of darkness at this time, give me strength, give us all strength, to take this light into the world, to share your love with others, especially vulnerable children and young people. And we remember particularly before you the work of the Children's Society. Guard and bless them. Amen. In your takeaway Christingle bag, you will have found an order of service. So I encourage you to take that out, gather round, and to join in with the words in bold. Christ has brought us out of darkness to live in his wonderful light. As we think of those who pre prepared the way for Christ, we say, Jesus, light of the world, shine in this place. Jesus, light of the world, shine in our hearts. Jesus, light of the world, shine in our lives. Jesus, light of the world, shine in all the earth. Amen. As we celebrate the great work of the Children's Society, we recognise that they support children and young people in some of the most difficult places of struggle and pain in our country. Children and young pe people who are experiencing places of real darkness. 
and the Christingle service has much to say about that. Each of us, in our own way, adds to the world's darkness. So before we say sorry to God and join in with a prayer of confession, let's keep a few moments of silence to think about those times when we have added to the world's darkness and the world's brokenness. Let us pray. Christ, the light of the world, has come to dispel the darkness of our hearts. In his light, let us examine ourselves and confess our sins. In a dark and disfigured world, we have not held out the light of life. Lord, have mercy. In a hungry and despairing world, we have failed to share our bread. Christ, have mercy. In a cold and loveless world, we have kept the love of God to ourselves. Lord, have mercy. May God, who loved the world so much that he sent his Son to be our Saviour, forgive you your sins and make you holy to serve him in the world. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. So I hope you have before you your homemade Christingle. I have mine here. And in your bags you will have found an orange, a piece of red ribbon, four cocktail sticks, some items to pop onto those cocktail sticks, and a candle and probably a little bit of tin foil as well, although I got a little carried away with mine and it's uh, wedged right into that orange. I wonder if you can remember what the different items represent. First up, we have the orange, spherical and round, so that it reminds us of the world that God created. The red ribbon wrapped around reminds us of God's love wrapped around the world, wrapped around us, and also reminds us of the blood that Christ shed on the cross. The dried fruits or the sweets, or in my case, the popcorn on your cocktail sticks, reminds us of God's creations for the many people and for all of the gifts that we receive from creation. The four cocktail sticks remind us of the four seasons or the four, point, four directions of the world, north, south, east and west. And then we have the candle, which we will light in just a short while. And the ca candle symbolises for us Jesus Christ, the light of the world, who brings to us and to all people hope, living in darkness. And so now we have a reading from the Gospel according to St John that tells us about John the Baptist, the one who pointed us or points us in the direction of Christ. There was a man sent from God whose name was John. He came as a witness to testify to the light so that all might believe through him. He himself was not the light, but he came to testify to the light. This is the testimony given by John when the Jews sent priests and Levites from Jerusalem to ask him, Who are you? He confessed and did not deny it, but confessed, I am not the Messiah. And they asked him, What then? Are you Elijah? He said, I am not. Are you the prophet? He answered, No. Then they said to him, Who are you? Let us have an answer. For those who sent us. What do you say about yourself? He said, I am the voice of one crying out in the wilderness. Make straight the way of the Lord, as the prophet Isaiah said. So let us respond to those words 
to the film that we've seen of the Children's Society and for the excitement that creating our Christingle has brought us. Jesus said, the people who walked in darkness have seen a great light. Jesus, you came as the light of the world. We pray for the places where there is darkness and danger and for the work of the Children's Society in sharing your light. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Jesus said, let the children come to me and do not stop them. Jesus, you gave children a special place in your kingdom. We pray for children in trouble and in need and for the work of the Children's Society in sharing your promise of hope. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Jesus said, love one another as I have loved you. Jesus, you cared for those who were poor and those who were sick, and you made friends with the people that nobody else would love. We pray for those in need in our community, our nation and in the world, and for the work of the Children's Society in sharing your love. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Jesus said, shine as lights in the world. Jesus, you call us to act justly and with kindness. We pray for wisdom as we work to make the world a better place and for the work of the Children's Society in fighting for hope for all children and young people. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Now we unite our prayers in saying the words of the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. And so now we come to light our Christingles. Please do this carefully and with an adult present. Um, and watch out for hair or anything else that might um, dangle near your uh, Christingle. And it's probably best to hold on to it rather than leave it on a table because they can wobble about a little bit. So as we say the first line of our prayer, I invite you to light your candles. Lord Jesus, light of the world, I hold this Christingle as a sign of your love. May we share your light in the darkness. The candle planted deep within the world as a sign that you made your home among us and lived with the poor and neglected. May we share your light in the darkness. The ribbon wrapped around the earth, a sign of your love shown on the cross, enfolding the whole world with your saving love. May we share your light in the darkness. The fruits and sweets, signs of all the good things you have made, given to us that we might share them fairly, so that everyone can have enough. May we share your light in the darkness. Lord Jesus, light of the world, as I hold this Christingle and think, think about your great love for me, help me to take this light out into the world and to share your love with others 
especially those that need it most. Amen. And now we sing, Christ be our light. Christ, the Son of Righteousness, shine upon you, scatter the darkness from before your path, and make you ready to meet him when he comes in glory. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, come upon you and remain with you always. Amen. Go into the world to walk in God's light, to rejoice in God's love, and to reflect God's glory. Amen.